welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be an unboxing video. Sarah, one of my swappers in the past, if you guys watched some of my swapping videos, like maybe a two years ago maybe. I'll probably link some of them in the description box down below so you guys can go and check it out. So Sarah and I used to swap and she's from France and recently she sent me a box which I am very grateful and thankful for um, because we actually haven't swapped in a while but throughout time she still sends me things and I thought I'd do this unboxing video to show you guys what I got from her and at the same time give her my first reaction on opening this box. She did send this or it arrived actually uh, during some time in the week but I thought I'd wait till the weekend to open it because I had a long week and I knew it was gonna be a long week so you know what this is a great surprise I thank her so much I've been really stressed out with work and everything but when this arrived I was like oh my god this is so exciting it's like Christmas happened in April <laughs> that's pretty much how it is Anyways, this may be a long video, and if so, I hope you guys, you know, sit back and relax, you know, grab a cup of tea or a cup of coffee and some snacks and enjoy. Anyways, let me get started. So the box is this big, and it does say that um, there could be a maximum of seven kilograms that's impacted in here. I'm like, whoa, girl, you sure sent me a lot of things. And let me open it. So once I opened it, there is of course a lovely little letter or a note that she uh, wrote to me telling me that um, this parcel has been really late, but hey girl, not a problem at all. I really thank you for doing this. So inside this box, I got a box of Lipton tea. This is the Earl, Earl Grey tea, uh, Lady Earl Grey. This is very interesting. Um, I really like Lipton tea, so this is awesome, and I'm running low on tea, so I'm glad you sent it to me at this time. There's a little pouch here with a little cute panda. Oh, and then she included a Hello Kitty. I believe this is an eyeshadow. Oh, it is. Oh, these are really pretty shades with a mirror on the other side and a swap or an applicator, I guess. She knows I love Hello Kitty. So there's a, I guess this is like one of those cell phone charms. So it's like a Hello Kitty, um, oh, sorry. The, the tag is right here. That is so cute. It looks like those macarons, like Hello Kitty macarons. Oh, this is so cute. So this is from me Toot House. This is a loofah, but in a shape of an ice cream cone. Perfect, because I actually was going to replace the loofah that I've been using because it's been falling apart. Oh, it's so cute. And then there's also this lavender. It says cleanse, purify, softens, re reveals radiance. I'm not exactly sure what this is. Oh, it's like one of those sponges that I can use. That's really cool. And lavender scented. That's always good. Always, always good. And of course, you know, I got bags of things. I'll open the, the bags of things later. I'll show you guys the small little things first. Oh, there's another one. This is like a Hello Kitty uh, donut with a, um, like it's a cell phone charm thing. It's cute, so cute. So, so it looks like she also got me a L'Occitane. Uh, I'm not sure if this is this year's or the year before considering she said it was a little late. Um, this is the advent calendar. I loved a lot of things that are in here so I am grateful that I pretty much got another one and I get to open up all those days in pretty much all at once considering it's already past Christmas so this is great. So inside there was also this tin, uh, this big tin, and I'm assuming there's stuff in here, so I'll show you guys. It's a really cute tin though. So I have a, ooh, I guess it's a Pez, a Hello Kitty Pez. Oh, it's so cute, and I love purple too. I don't know why my camera picks it up as a light blue, but it's purple. And another cute Pez right here as well. A Hello Kitty pencil. Oh man, I am in love with Hello Kitty right now. This is 
a Hello Kitty pencil sharpener, which, which is perfect because she gave me a pencil. A Hello Kitty face foaming net. Oh, this is cool. I, I think I have one, but I've yet to try it out. But hey, a Hello Kitty one's even better. Oh my God, I was actually gonna buy this for myself and it's the Hello Kitty facial brush, but I haven't been able to justify it to myself for um, the price that I needed to pay. And she got me one, thank you. There's also this Hello Kitty tin like thing. Oh, their mini brush kit. Oh, cool. This is perfect, perfect to travel around. Oh, and they're pretty soft actually. Oh. Yay! And of course, I get some eye masks. These Hello Kitty sexy look brightening stretch eye masks. Yay! I love these. Like, they're just so cute. And yeah. She also gave me a Hello Kitty plushie. I believe it's another one of those uh, cell phone kind of ones. They're so cute. There's also Hello Kitty, I think these are blotting sheets. I can never have enough blotting sheets, like seriously. <laughs> Love that. And she got me another pack right here as well. They're really cute. I mean, there are two different types of packaging. This one, apparently when it opens up, it has like a 3D kind of um, like Hello Kitty that pops up. And you know, this is more for, I guess, like throwing it in my purse and carrying it around. Ooh, what is this? This is a Hello Kitty body brush. Oh my God. It's like this whole set is like together. I didn't actually see this one. That's pretty cool. I can't wait to try this out. And maybe I'll do like a first impression video or something like that in the future. So you guys can, you know, see how it's like. Last but not least that's in this box is of course the bag that I showed you. Uh, this is a really nice bag and a very, very cute one. Definitely one where I can like carry things around. Oh my God. And look, it's a bunch of makeup stuff in here. Oh my God. So this is the Kiko. I love Kiko brand. Definitely is my thing. This one is in light to medium. This is a, hmm, I think it's a bronzer. Yes. Oh, look how pretty that is. I feel like it fits my skin tone because I'm not a person that really likes too dark of like bronzers. This is a macaron hand cream from, I can't really tell, some Korean brand. I thought it was totally moly, but I might be wrong, but it's really cute. There's more Kiko stuff. So this is a Color Up Long Lasting Eyeshadow in 20. Ooh, look at this. It's like a really, really nice purple shade. Wow, I've been always afraid of wearing purple, but I want to venture out of my own little comfort zone and actually play around with these colors. And there's another one in number 33 oh and it's a lighter purple Ooh, maybe i can do like a gradient look with this that's actually really cool oh and of course she knows i love purple yet i have tried it on my eyes but she gave me another one of lafard um this is another purple light purple um eyeshadow there's another Kiko Tropical Waterproof Eyeliner in 05. I can never have enough eyeliners. Oh my God, look how pretty this color is. It's a really nice purple shade. Like a purpley fuchsia purple, I guess, is what I'm trying to get at. There's a, this is the Famous Eyes Crayon Jumbo. I don't exactly know what this is. Oh, ooh, I like this shade. It's like a champagne color, great for like the inner corners of my eyes where I wanted to brighten up. Ooh, and I love it in a stick form, so that all I need to do is just doot doot and then smudge it in a little. And of course, there's also a Lord and Berry um, Sparkle Black. So it's like a sparkly eyeliner kind of um, pencil with a bit of shimmers. 
There is a anti-aging, this is a, it says weekly treatment. Oh, multivitamin mask in a travel size. So that'd be interesting. Cause yeah, I mean, my skin is getting to the age where I need to worry about anti-aging, you know, like products like that. And oh, I like this color too. This is a glossy mauve eyeshadow. So it's like a brownish gray kind of color. Ooh, ooh, this is cool. And it's a really nice package uh, nail polish. It has like shimmering purple in it all over. I just really like the packaging that it's like, it's like pretty much like a woman, you know? Like a figure of a woman is what I'm trying to say. And there's another one in a lighter purple. Ooh, this one's nice. Uh, there's also, I think this is like a face brush, like a cleansing face face brush. Oh, and then she got me the Etude House Berry Licious Scrub and Wash. I believe this is for, yeah, for the body. Ooh, I love berry scented things and she knew that, so thank you. Of course, it also came with a body milk. That's always nice. <laughs> and she also got me the, but uh, from Etude House as well, the bunny nails. These are the duels. Oh, it's so cute. It's so pretty. And last but not least that's in this bag is, oh, Zoya. Wow. This is a purple with gold shimmers in it. Oh, love it. I felt like all the things that she's collected in the past pretty much reminds her of me. Uh, whether it's purple, Hello Kitty, cute, strawberry scented, oh my god, she like personalized this box for me and it totally made my week. Anyways, I thank her so much. Sarah, if you are watching, thank you, thank you, thank you. I can't say enough about that and I really hope that we can swap again in the future. Anyhow, I hope the rest of you guys enjoyed watching this video, and if so, remember to give me that thumbs up. I do try to upload one to two new videos each week, so stay tuned. Um, subscribe, and of course, click on that little bell for your notifications. Anyhow, I shall see you guys in my next one. Bye-bye for now.